All right, welcome back to another episode of Barbecue Bourbon and Blues with the Word Brothers. I'm your host, Khalid Word, with my brother. Hey, how y'all doing? I am Skip. How y'all doing good today? Hope you're doing well. And as uh, my brother said, we're Word Brothers Barbecue, one of the best in the South. And you'll know it when you put this meat in your mouth. Yeah. All right, so today, on this episode, we're going to do a banana, a dessert. We're going to do a Bananas Foster's bread pudding on the smoker, all right? So, as you can see, we got a table full of goodness right here. But before we get into that, we're going to do a little rum tasting today because in this Bananas Foster bread pudding, it calls for, it calls for rum. So we're going to get into one of our favorite rums. One of our favorite rums. We have several. This is one. Yep. All right. So uh, let us know what it is. Toastmaster. All right. Today we're gonna be uh, sipping on a little bit of Bacardi Black. All right. It's made a little bit outside of Cuba, but I think today's uh, distillery is actually in Puerto Rico now. Um, it's from actually from Puerto Rico. Uh, when you when you taste it, you get hints of uh, nutmeg, molasses, um, dog uh, sort of a dark chocolate taste also all right so today let's get in without further ado since this is one of our favorites i don't really have to we don't have to it's not a lot to explain about not a lot it. to explain if you know about bacardi you know uh, it's very good you know back in our day we used to drink that uh bacardi when it uh 151 yes sir they no longer make that no more but then 151 was one of my favorite goals to go to but this, yeah. this Bacardi Black is just as good. Man, you get you some of that one fifty Bacardi 151 and get you some summer sausage. That's what one of my team, my, <laughs> one, when, when I coach one of my team, uh, one of my players on my team, his parents had, we were in Florida playing for a national championship and he made me come and sit down with him and have some 151 and some summer sausage. And that was probably one of the best combinations I had. Oh, uh, man, your stomach probably wasn't right after you drank one fifty one and summer it sausage. Was, it wasn't not that much, it was just like a little shot. Well, that's all you needed at 151. Yeah. Like, it'll, it'll, it'll take you there quick. Yeah, it gets you there. Definitely. All right, so now we're going to take, we're going to taste this Bacardi 151. I mean, excuse me, Bacardi <laughs> Black. Black. See, he done took me back to like 2009, all right? Thank you, sir. All right. Yeah, nice little smell to it. Yeah. Dark nice color. One. Here we go. Here Cheers. We go. Cheers, y'all. Yeah, that's delicious. Definitely. Yeah, it yeah. goes down real easy. We we'll probably like to add a little bit more than what you uh, got sitting out for this recipe. Nah, we gotta nah, make nah. It right. Now nah, we good, man. We good with this recipe. All right, I promise you we good with this recipe. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, because we got those giveaways. Don't forget about that. It's going to be coming up real soon. Yeah, we got the bottle of Wellers and the live and studio audience that yeah. can come in. And you could be here and be a part be of the show. Live. That's right. So first, without further ado, we're going to start this recipe. We're going to start with two eggs, all right? So I'm going to crack the eggs, get them in. Then what you gonna do after that? With these two eggs, I'm gonna whisk them or scramble them, as they say. You wanna scramble it, get it real smooth in this bowl. You gotta get your wrist game. Your wrist yep. game gotta be up, up to pop. Yeah, gotta make it whip, as they say. Get it right. All right, so we getting these scrambled. Go ahead, I, I'll take over. All right, over. so he's gonna scramble. While he's scrambling these, I'm going to add four cups of milk. Keep scrambling. Whisking, man. We ain't scrambling. Yeah. Whisking, scrambling, whatever you want to call it. All right. Four cups of milk in. All right. Now he's going to whisk that in. Now, now that we have our mixture together with the eggs and milk, the next thing we're gonna add is our brown sugar, all right? It's a cup and a half of dark brown sugar. All right, we're gonna get that in there. 
we're gonna take a cup of white sugar. White. We're gonna get that in there. All right. Then we're gonna take our cinnamon here. All right, take our cinnamon and we're gonna get it in. Alright, we got the cinnamon in there. Cinnamon in. It's whisking it up real good. It's looking good. We gotta do this like we gotta do this like a relay, man. This is your turn. My turn? <laughs> Alright. So the next thing we're gonna get in here, that's cause he need to get in the weight room. <laughs> you know, we'll discuss that a little later. The wheat need to get in the weight room. Alright, so we got that in here. Next thing we're gonna add, a little vanilla extract. All right, so we're gonna get that in here. I'm gonna keep stirring. Now, if you may have kids, you may want to use the imitation raw, just in case the kids don't want to. Man, you don't want the kids to have alcohol. It, true, but you don't even worry about that. It'll cook. It'll cook out. You don't have to worry about it. All right, next thing we're gonna get in is our favorite Bacardi Black Rum. All right. Gonna get that in here. We're gonna keep on whisking it in until it's smooth. Now you want to make it real smooth, okay? You want no lumps of sugar or anything in here. You want it smooth, just like the milk we poured in, okay? All right. And I think we just about the consistency is almost Yep. I think we, I think we've done that. If you come in closer with the camera, they can see that is smooth, just like look like chocolate milk. That's gonna be delicious, I'm telling y'all. I know that's gonna be good. I can smell it. You, I wish you could smell it through the camera, but you can't. So, if you're in the live studio audience, who knows, we might do a peach cobbler that day or something for the dessert. But we are gonna get this in. The next thing we are gonna do is we are gonna add our bread, all right? So, we're gonna keep on whisking this and make sure it's to the consistency that we want. And then we'll be right back with you with barbecue bourbon and blues with the word brothers. A few seconds. Keep whisking, buddy. All right, we're back with barbecue bourbon and blues with the word brothers. As you can see, we're still whisking. We wanted to get that smooth consistency. We like our stuff. I like mine to be like well mixed up. All right, so I'm gonna keep whisking. Right now we have three bananas, we sliced them, okay? And we are gonna take half of those three and I'm gonna get my brother here to Let's take these up. and he's gonna crush them a little bit in his hands and add them to this mixture, okay? All right. So he's gonna be smashing them. Yep, just let them fall in just like so, all right? And I'm still whisking the whole time. That way, it's all getting mixed in. This is gonna make your bread pudding. This is gonna get it off the chain. All right? Here we go. He's smashing more. He's mixing them in. And it's getting into that mixture and it's smelling real nice right now. Excellent. Keep going, bro. Yeah. Keep going. Like Jay is like Jay Z and Benny Siegel when he was rapping and Freeway. Ain't that? Yeah, free. That was the song. Yeah. Philadelphia Freeway. Keep going, brother. So we getting it, we getting it mixed in. Knock that banana down in there. And in a few seconds, after he gets this last little bunch squeezed up, crushed up, I'll show you the consistency of your liquid. You want to get as much banana in there as you can, okay? Good deal, bro. Appreciate it. All right. All right, so now we got our mixture going. And as you can see, I stirred it the entire time. You can do this by yourself, too, if you had to. But with two people, it makes it much easier. Okay, so we got that. Now, as you can see, the mixture is all mixed up. It's 
like chocolate mint. It is delicious. You can smell it. You can smell the rum. You can smell the vanilla. You can smell it all, okay? So I'm gonna keep stirring. And now, I'm gonna add the bread while my brother stirs a little bit, okay? So, what we what we done here is we took about two loaves of bread and we cut it in inch cubes, okay? So I basically what I did was sliced it in thirds and made like a checkerboard, so to, so to speak, all right? You wanna get it in inch cubes. And we're just gonna add it to this mixture here, okay? So as you can see, I'm just gonna pour it in. Let him do his thing with his, his whisker. Wanna make sure all the bread pieces get covered. That's right, you don't want any dry pieces of bread when you do this, okay? So we're gonna keep on adding bread, letting him add it in, and then you can stop whisking. Now you can just grab it and use your gloves. Well, I use my gloves and I'll let you keep keep on uh, adding bread, okay? So we're just gonna mix it up real good, as you can see. Add some more bread for me, bro. I'll let you knock right. it down. I had to take off those banana. Blue. That's fine. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna mix this up, keep mixing it until it's a nice consistency, okay? Alright, so like I said, you're gonna do just make sure all the bread gets nice and soggy and soaked with the mixture that we uh got concocted up. Alright, like I said, no dry pieces. We're gonna continue to do this and we'll be back, all right, in a few minutes and show you what we have. Barbecue bourbon and blues with the Word Brothers, okay? All right, we're back. So we've got this all mixed up, as you can see. Now I'm gonna add the slices of banana and get them in, okay? So I'm gonna take these and I'm gonna place these all over the place. You don't want them in one bunch. Get them everywhere. And then you just gonna add them in and you gonna mix these up as well, okay? All right, so they're going in all over. As you can see. I'm gonna get these in and then we just gonna give it a mix with our hands again, okay? So there you go, you see it all over the place. And I'm gonna mix this up with my hands again. And I don't wanna, you don't wanna crush these banana slices, okay? You just wanna mix it up real good, get them all over the place. And then we're gonna get it in a pan. We're gonna get it on that smoker going at 350 and it's gonna be delicious, okay? All right. So I got these all mixed in everywhere. I would show you, I don't want to pick the pan up, but they are all over the place, okay? So you have your crushed bananas, you have your banana slices in here, okay? Now we're gonna get it in the pan. Just gonna pick it up and slide it in. And I smooth it out. Smooth it out. And then we'll get it in the smoker and it'll be ready to rock. This is gonna be delicious, I'm telling y'all. That the rum and stuff and the vanilla is gonna set it off. Okay? This is bananas fosters bread pudding. There you go. Now I'm gonna spread it out. Spread these bananas out a little bit more. Now we're gonna get it on the smoker here in just a second. Alright? So Got our mix together, as you can see. This is what it should look like. We're gonna get that in the smoker, going to 350. We'll see you at the smoker in one second. Barbecue Bourbon and Blues with the Word Brothers. All right, welcome back to Barbecue Bourbon and Blues. 
We're down here at the master bill 1050 as usual. All right, we're gonna get our bread putting in. It's gonna roll at 350 degrees. Now we're gonna put it in and we're gonna cook it until it's done. All right, now, <laughs> now, now, seriously though, y'all, I'll come back and let you know and I'll put it in the description below how long it's supposed to, ro supposed to roll, but it depends on your smoker, your grill, or whatever you're doing it on, okay? So, we're gonna get this on the grill, on the smoker, and we're gonna let it roll, all right? And then I have the times and all of that down below, but you want your smoker rolling at 350, okay? okay. Bottom of the top. Now you can put it on the bottom, in the bro, in the middle. In the middle. We're gonna put it on the bottom rack in the middle, that way it cooks evenly, all right? There you go, it's on, it's ready to rock. We'll be back with you in a little bit with Banana Sponsors Bread Pudding, Barbecue Bourbon and Blues with the Word Brothers. Catch you later. All right, welcome back to Barbecue Bourbon and Blues with the Word Brothers Barbecue. As you can see, this Banana Foster Bread Pudding is starting to take shape. You can see a couple of holes in here where we check the consistency. What you want to do is use a, a little skew, a skewer or your um, your probe and stick it in and make sure that it comes out clean. When it comes out clean, you know it's ready to go, all right? So next, we're getting ready to make our Bananas Foster sauce that we're going to put on top of this as a topping and, and get it right, okay? And everybody's gonna love it, I promise. Promise you that. So I'm gonna set this to the side, let it start resting, and then you're gonna meet me at the stove and we're gonna start making the sauce for the topping for this banana Foster bread pudding. See you in a second. Barbecue bourbon and blues, word brothers. All right, welcome back to Barbecue Bourbon and Blues with the Word Brothers. We're making this Bananas Foster's, smoked Bananas Foster's bread pudding, all right? On the stove here, I have one cup of butter, okay? One cup of butter, a cup and a half of brown sugar, all right? And we're just gonna keep stirring this. It takes a while, so. I'm gonna even kick the fire up a little bit. And you wanna stir this until it's smooth, all right? And then we're gonna add in some dark brown rum. I'm gonna get my brother to add in some dark brown rum and some vanilla um, extract, all right? Make sure your whip game is proper. Yeah, your whip game gotta be proper because you want it to be smooth, okay? So I'm gonna keep on whipping this as you can see, until it's smooth. You see that mixture there? See it? All right. Now you gotta be careful because you don't want to spill it on yourself because you burn yourself bad. So you grab a hold of it. And like I said in the in the in the video about how to make a good how to have a successful barbecue, you can't get lit and do this. All right. You gotta be. You gotta be completely sober, okay? Unless you're this brother right here behind me. And then if he burn himself with this mixture, he won't feel it until the next day. And then I'm gonna laugh at him. Or it gotta be the old man with the cane gold on and, and well, you get it. So we're gonna, we gonna keep on whipping this up. And as you can see, it's starting to thicken up. You see that? Start thicken up, we're gonna keep whipping. Teeth get it right. All right, so we're gonna keep on whipping this and then we'll be back to you shortly, okay? Barbecue, bourbon, and blues with the word, brothers. See you in a second. All right, we're back. Barbecue, bourbon, and blues with the word, brothers. Now my brother's gonna add in vanilla. Some vanilla. Boom. Turn it in. And some rum. Ooh. Ooh, buddy. 
And you know he always likes a little more. So we just gonna keep on stirring this. Let it thicken up. All right, here we go back with barbecue bourbon and blues. I'm making the sauce for our bananas foster, you know, bread pudding. In this is a cup of butter, a cup and a half of brown sugar, vanilla extract, and some rum, all right? We're gonna get it in. It's been rolling, we've stirred it up. We're getting it good. Put the little rum. Now we're gonna get these bananas in here, all right? We're getting the bananas in. We're gonna continue stirring them up. Get them in. All right, so we're gonna get these in, stir it up a little bit more, get them going. I'm gonna keep some of these whole. So I'm gonna let this roll a little bit and then we gonna plate it up for you, have it ready for you, all right? But you gotta get this, you wanna get your, your sauce, you wanna get it to a good consistency. See you back in a minute, barbecue bourbon and blues with the Word Brothers. All right, welcome, to, welcome back to Barbecue Bourbon and Blues with the Word Brothers. We finished up our segment on the Bananas Foster's Bread Pudding. Showed you how to do it all. Got it bowled up. Look at that. Now, I'm about to take me a bite of this. And by the way it smells, I know it's going to be delicious. So I'm about to dig in you see that look at that oh ho, look at it yeah you look at it mm. wish you was here to get some of this it's delicious I'm about to go in for another bite but make sure you subscribe comment and like Cause you know about the giveaways now, you know what's going down. You know you can be here for this live taping. You know you can win the Wellers. So make sure you hop on that. Share it and like it with your friends so they can hop on it too. And I guarantee you, we gonna have barbecue, bourbon, and blues the whole day with the Word Brothers and it's gonna go down. But this here, Bananas Fosters, good, all right? See that? Mm-hmm. Take me another bite. I'll see y'all later. I'm about to sit down and enjoy myself with this, okay? Subscribe and like to the channel, all right? I'll see y'all later. Barbecue, bourbon, and blues. Word, brothers. Mm-hmm.